Hey, this is Kathy from Kathy Cooks For You, and welcome to my kitchen. We are going to make some of these RX bars. Now, there's very simple ingredients in these. Three egg whites, six almonds, four cashews, two dates, and no BS. This one is a butter, so it's just like a mushy mixture. This one was a bar. This is one egg white, 27 peanuts, a half a date, and no BS. But you know what is BS about these? The price. But like one of these is $2.50 at the grocery store. So stay tuned. We're going to take the BS out of the RX bar and we're going to take the BS out of the RX nut butter. All right, as we begin, I wanted to say disclaimer. I have not done this before. I have not made up some great grandiose recipe. I just know I bought one of these before and thought, I can do this and it's much cheaper. Now I round, rounded the 27 peanuts to 25 because about 25 peanuts equals an ounce. So we are using 100% peanut butter. All that's in here is peanuts and a little salt to make it taste good. So we are putting four ounces of peanut butter in here. And because I'm not really sure if this is gonna turn out right, I'm not making a huge portion of it. So we got our peanuts in. Now egg white. This isn't going to be cooked, so I'm not going to use a regular egg white. I am using egg white protein. Nothing else but egg white protein. And I'm going to put one tablespoon. One tablespoon is equal to an egg white. Now, if you wanted it, the consistency of an egg white, you would add, it says right on the back, one large egg white equals one tablespoon egg white protein and three tablespoons water. So we're going to hold off on the water just to see how sticky this is. We have our two dates, because one packet has a half a date, so we're multiplying this times four, so we're using two dates. Mine have seeds, so I gotta take my seeds out. Get my hands all gooey. They don't dry out if the seed's still in them, so that's why I buy them with the seed in them, and that way, you know, they're not dry and crystallized. They last much longer. Okay, egg white, check. Peanuts, check. Dates, check. Is that it? Well, then below here it says honey, cinnamon, peanut butter. So, you know, I looked on the back and they put a little honey, little cinnamon, sea salt, and coconut oil, and natural flavors. What's natural flavors? I'm really not sure. But I'm going to say my natural flavors is a drop or two of my homemade vanilla. So I'm just going to put, oh, I should measure this since I am on TV. I'm going to put a teaspoon for now of honey. And then uh, just a dash of cinnamon. So we're gonna pulse it. And we're gonna see if it's liquidy enough. Okay. Oh, it's a nice pretty ball. Ooh, I lost the top of my thing. Okay, let's give it a try. Okay, that is perfect for me. I would not want um I wouldn't want it sweeter. It's perfect. But I can see other people wanting um, two teaspoons to a tablespoon. And that also is going to um, see how, you know, kind of just, there's another little piece in there, but it's a nice little ball. And um, it tastes delicious. So let's try the difference and see which we like better. And of course, I'm going to lie. Okay, this is a little gooier, and that's probably because of the coconut oil. So if you want it gooey or have some co coconut oil. It's good. It's very good. That's why I like it. I just don't want to pay two bucks for one of these. Let me try this one. This one has more cinnamon and more honey. But I like the consistency of this one better without this this one's runnier so now what we're gonna do is you know you hate to like use packaging like this but you're buying it with packaging so why not just put these in here you can put them in the freezer in your fridge flatten them out you could put two in there a serving of two in fact that's what I'm gonna do just so I'm not so wasteful and that didn't cost me four dollars I doubt this barely even cost a dollar. I mean, the peanut butter, 
peanut butter. I mean, it, much cheaper, much cheaper. You're making it yourself. You know exactly what's in there. So we have our egg whites, our peanuts, our dates, and we took out the BS and just have a delicious, healthy snack without all that cost. Is that not amazing? On to number two. This one is the um, chocolate RX bar. So it's three egg whites, six almonds, four cashews, two dates, and they say no BS, but we know there's BS in there because it costs so much. So I'm putting a half cup of almond butter with chocolate. The cocoa powder is already in here. If you use regular almond butter, just put a tablespoon of cocoa powder and you can sweeten it with some honey or sugar or maple syrup, whatever you want to sweeten it with, and just sweeten it one teaspoon at a time until you get the desired sweetness. And then we have 40 cashews, because this recipe is four cashews, and if I times it by 10, that's 40. 40 cashews, 20 dates, see this is a much bigger recipe, 20 dates, stack my bowls, and here we have, this is my dilemma. So to extrapolate this out, because they use three egg whites, that's 30 egg whites. So that's almost two cups of egg white powder. And that makes me a little nervous. So I'm going to just put the egg white powder, one cup in, and we're just gonna see what happens. If I wanna add more, I can, but this is how my brain works. You know, it just seemed like a lot, so why try it? I'd rather wait. And again, I have some water I can add too because egg whites normally have water. These are all dehydrated. So we're gonna start pulsing this and let's find out if this is going to be a good bar. Okay, let's look at it. Oh, wrong way. Okay, a little dry. Some pieces are coming together. Let me just... It definitely does not taste chocolate enough. I'm gonna put some chocolate chips in and I think I'm gonna end it just with that. If you don't wanna put chocolate chips in, you can put a tablespoon of chocolate powder in here at a time. But you know what? Let's do one tablespoon of chocolate powder. I've got some right here by my smoothie station. Because the color of this too, you know, doesn't look like chocolate. And if you're wanting something chocolatey, it kind of has to look like chocolate too, right? At least in my brain. That's why white chocolate just isn't chocolate. It's candy. Okay, let's see how that looks. I am adding a dry ingredient, which might make it drier. Okay, let's see what we have here. Oh, now it looks chocolatey. I think I'm going to leave it right there. Now we add some mini chips. Let's see, handful, maybe two handfuls. Okay, and the mini chips won't really get too chopped up in here, and I'm just going to do a real, real quick. I might have to mix those in with my hands. Okay, so I put the dough into this pan and this is like a 10 by 10 I'd say it looks like the perfect size and they look fabulous time to taste them okay looks wise mine blows this out of the park um, it's look at that I mean you can see this I mean you can tell this is homemade compared to this brick mine it's soft and beautiful and with and you can see the cashews and then I put the chips in here now if I break it apart like I've had this before you know like I see a piece of chocolate there so I'm gonna eat that part that has the chocolate because that's the best part right okay I bit into it it's sticking right here and right here it's all over my teeth 
that wasn't that pleasant. I feel like I need to check my teeth. Just one second. Okay, my teeth are better. I can smile now. Now let me try this one. That's delicious. Now, maybe next time I put these in ball form. Put them in a ball and you can do the chocolate chips around it. Ooh, that would be pretty. I cannot tell you the difference in flavor and texture um, that these two have. Uh, now also, if you want to put, you can make chocolate coffee, put a little instant coffee in with it. Ooh, that'd be good. Absolutely spectacular. Thank you so much for watching Kathy Cooks for you. RX, I'm sorry, but I believe the price of these are BS and I had to debunk it, break it down and make my own version that tastes so much better. So much better. Please subscribe to Kathy Cooks for you and watch some more of my videos. Have a great day.